what we do here is go back, 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 back. Well, this is a bit different because the last time I mentioned or talked about this man was about four years ago when I had reacted to him violating a chicken sandwich. Y'all should go watch it for lower purposes and then come back to this video. literally posted me on his page reacting to said video and his creepy fans were more focused about my age at the time which I was 19 but they thought I was 15 which was very weird. He even left a comment on my channel that is still there to this day. This is his actual channel. From being known as a man who made love with a chicken sandwich and ate his special sauce to being called in 4k countless of times for me and a minor, this is the story about Lil Mar where they at now. Lil Mar or Lamar Cruz started his career as a typical meme sound called leper with music as shitty as a tattoo in his face. Lamar, and let's get it. She said, <laughs> I said, yeah. His music kind of took off, but what really made him viral was his antics behind the mic, such as literally fucking him a chicken sandwich. And if you do not believe me, I can link the video of me reacting to it or look it up. Trust me, it is there. I do not recommend watching it before you eat. Outside of that fuckery, if he's not fucking a chicken sandwich, he's nine times out of ten fucking a drug addict for sixty dollars, which is honestly sad but true. He documented the entire ordeal on Snapchat. A fucking dead end at this weird ass looking creepy hotel. Wish me luck. The destination is on your right. Woo! I did it. I lost my virginity. Who a virgin? Who a virgin? Ain't no motherfucking virgin. Not no more than I ain't. You know the fuck though. I don't stop playing me, bro. Ain't no motherfucking virgin. No this is honestly the only time he found somebody his age. A literal drug addict. This guy is a definition of types of people that will get their nut and then brag about it. Okay. <laughs> okay. You know, guys, I just scored coaching from a random drug addict with no care for the possible health issues in the future. I unfortunately encountered a video that he made talking about how he met up with a minor, but quickly said she lied about her age. You can see in the uh, title, I'm going to start a new series called Story Times. And today, I'm going to be talking about the time where I met up with a 12 year old. <laughs> but wait! <laughs> now, uh, before before uh, I get started on this video, I do need to let y'all know that she lied about her age. This was like, I, I did not intentionally meet up with a 12 year old. I would never do that. That's disgusting. But also, I was only 16 at the time, and she lied and told me she was 14. But today, I'm gonna I'm tell, I'm gonna explain what happened. I wish I was making this up. There was also a time Lil Moore took the biggest L by driving an hour to meet up with a girl under the attention that she was gonna give him some kitty cat, only for her to clown him and call him a meme. Girl made me drive a whole hour. Hey, what's so, up? And she said she was gonna let me f And I'm here, and now she says she's not gonna let me f are you gonna let him? Like, do you see this? Come on! He's so ugly. The. Then why would you say that? Because I wanted to meet you because you're a fing meme. Wait, you said what? I'll give you a kiss on the cheek. Okay. He just sat there and take it while calling it internally. That man's ego had to be in pieces after that. Shit hit the fan on October 2019 when Little Moore, along with his friend, were arrested for S.A. and a minor at a local Walmart in Chester in his country. And this is what 19-year-old Monty said that still stands to this day. How's jail for you, bruh? I hope you don't drop the soap. <laughs> I hope Big Daddy Debo isn't busting your cheeks every night. I have no idea why they didn't throw away the key with this one. Despite being caught in 4K with his friend stalking and literally assaulting a minor, his only pathetic excuse is yo, she lied about her age or she wanted to shtick. As of right now, Little Moore is shockingly on TikTok with the weird shit such as recording himself wearing a diaper and, and trying to stay relevant. Allegedly, he's also being a creep on TikTok as well, so this man has not changed at all. It is unfortunate that society makes people like this famous but shit on Mr. Beast for doing good things. Mind you, this is the same man that made a horrible April Fool's joke. Right now, guys, what you guys think of this situ of this of this guy? I still discuss it to this day, even talking about this man. But hey, fuck it, y'all voted for it. Make sure you guys like, share, subscribe, and make the bell for future notifications channel. It's your girl Mighty Two Times signing off.